I know why we're doing this on the way up. It's gonna be wild on the way down. Yeah. <laughs> hey everyone, Miner Biker here. I am on the top of the very north end of the Pavant Mountain Range. So, looking up here to the west, this is out into Millard Valley. So, I-15 runs right along down here. Scipio Summit is just out of sight that way, out towards the town of Delta out there in the flats and then out across the west desert towards notch peak and so on fillmore is just out of sight back that way a gorgeous view looking off that direction we're right here on the spine of the mountain range running here along the top from over here and running this way is what's called the scipio pass trail it's just an extremely rough old forest service horse and hiking trail my very favorite kind of trail to ride my mountain bike on as you know well Straight across from us right here through this little tree cut is the top of the Cutler Canyon Trail. We hiked that once. It's a cool old trail, but it's very, very steep and very overgrown. Don't know if that one's ever really gonna be one to do on a bike. We'll see what we're here to do today. So we're actually gonna go back this direction a little bit on the Scipio Pass Trail, and then we're gonna descend down what's called Loafers Canyon. So we came up, hiked and biked all the way up it to get to here. Now we're going to turn around and go back down, and it's a rough, steep little wild trail too, so it should be pretty fun. And I've got the one little dog here with me. The other dog, my wife, took a head start hiking that direction. She brought her bike up as far as she wanted to, and then just hiked the rest of the way. So we'll meet up with her and the other dog on the way. So here we go. So this is the Scipio Pass Trail. This runs from the end of the Robbins Valley Road. Ways off to the south here, all the way over to Scipio Summit. Very, very seldom used old four service trail up here. There we've seen like six piles of bear scat on the way up. It's kind of fun. None of them super fresh, but. Some of them probably within the last day or so at least. Definitely some happy bear activity going on out here. Looks like a minor biker style trail for sure. Yeah, so climb up across this ridge for just a little bit to get to the top of Loafers Canyon. Went over there to start the video since over here where Loafers tops up, you really can't see any of the view. The trees are too thick. That's how I came over here to get to where it opened up. And we could actually see and get the view off to the west. And this old trail is fun to ride too. Got up to you already. We were up here oh, almost a month ago now. Hiked up this, brought the saw, silky saw, and cut these trees off of it.
too bad down there. Pretty amazing when you know how to use your front brake, how much control you can maintain even down to the steep loose stuff. That front wheel can get a lot more bite than the back can for sure. And when riding stuff like this, I lower my tire pressure down lower than what I'd run, say riding the Richfield trails or something. So my tires are a little softer just for the purpose of getting more grip in the loose stuff. And I know I'm not gonna be going super fast or hitting things really hard. Great old trail, huh? This cairn right here marks the Loafers Canyon turnoff. It is not obvious and there's no trail sign. So we just came down from up there. The Scipio Pass Trail continues this way. But right there going that way is the Loafers Canyon Trail. If you don't know where it's at, you have no idea. But there is this cairn to mark it. So that's where we're going, down Loafers Canyon now. storm <laughs> oh my word there's so many of those bugs oh my gosh <laughs> that is crazy <laughs> oh my good heavens that was nuts how many of those little moths there are now we're coming down through this little stretch that we my wife and I refer to as the Christmas tree forest there's all these beautiful little pines so pretty down through here <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> Another testament to there being bears up here besides the six piles of bear scat that we've seen. You can see there one's been digging in that tree. This is one of the bigger trees we hacked a few weeks ago. Ooh, not much track. 
Move! Get out of my way, you Dumbo! Jeez! <laughs> Dive in there right in front of me. He really wanted to get run over, huh? Apparently. Ah, that's a really tight squeeze. It's kind of cool in here. I think this is a old sheep camp area from way back in the day. This old, old barrel stove right here. Got the door there in the front. And then your smoke vent there in the back. Cook the food on that old thing. And you got some trees down. They haven't come down since we were here at the saw. This upper part's been the pretty chill, easy part of loafers. It's gonna get wild here shortly. Oh. <laughs> Another good tree. Spun around. <laughs> ah, that's too loose. Oh, no river stones. Steep end off camera all at the same time.
nuts. I said we're about to the steep and gnarly spot. Well, we're here now. <laughs> little traction. <laughs> wow! Woo. Well, that's at least the worst of it. Now, Trust the old TRP quadians. Solid as a rock, never let me down. And quite the hike a bike to go up, as I'm sure you can imagine.
Pick rock. Rock slab there for a second. Instant engagement for the win. <laughs> oh, battle. There, I can't see the ground. <laughs> Guard. <laughs> <Woo -hoo>. ah. washed out through here. Hey, I cut that tree a few weeks ago. the loafers came forward the trail it comes about a mile and a half up into the canyon here now I'm forward the trail the rest of the way out and obviously my wife's on her bike not having to walk anymore that is her new Fazari wire peak e-bike which she absolutely loves and is doing awesome things with very cool bike. Oh, come on, just pop that little guy. <laughs> ah, I'll get stabbed by that one. Good boy, bud. Yeah. Smash 
that maple. <laughs> That's why I have a helmet. Helmet's not for hitting the ground, it's for hitting trees. back to the truck and yes in case anyone's wondering we got a new truck it's not the usual blue Tacoma we now have a much newer red Tacoma hello everyone that was fun and definitely a little wild I've been wanting to bring the bike and try low first Canyon for a while we've hiked it a few times I always thought it'd be wild and sketchy but also fun on a bike I just knew I had to try it and we finally came and did it and it was just that wild and sketchy and definitely fun so hopefully you all enjoyed that and uh check out any other videos it'll be linked in the cards in the upper right hand corner make sure to check out fazari bicycles as always because they are awesome like my wife's new wire peak and my true and faithful good old lasalle peak right there so such awesome bikes great company as always also leave a like for the dogs down there in the shade Leave us a comment down below, and if you've subscribed, thank you so much. If you haven't, I invite you to do so. Check out the other videos on the channel. Keep digging up new places to ride and adventure. Get out in the great outdoors under your own power.